All right, coming up next, it's a UFC Women's Phantomweight Division matchup. So here she is, one of the more prolific kickboxers to cross into the UFC in some time. She might kick harder than you, though. Oh, yeah, she does kick so hard. I mean, you look at the videos. The videos are all out there. And you watch this young lady landing these brutal leg kicks on the bag, landing the high kicks, the body kicks. It's, it's unreal to watch someone of this stature able to land and be as physical as she is. She's so aggressive in her approach. She's so comfortable in such tight confines that her opponents usually panic because they can't understand, as we can, how she can be okay when she's under duress as she is. I asked her to kick me in the leg at our fighter meeting on Thursday, and as you see, I'm still limping. So she packs some power, and her opponent better be ready for her here tonight. All right, so here she is, the decorated kickboxer, back for another run here in the UFC. Such a wide, vast array of kicks and punches in her arsenal, but it all comes back to elite technique. Oh, yeah, she has phenomenal technique. There is no wasted action. What I really love is the left hook. She does a great job of throwing her left hook behind her right hand. She throws the right hand, and the left hook follows. It's always so tight. It's always so clean. And then outside leg kick, every combination ends with a kick. When you think it's over, she's putting one more technique, one more opportunity to put some damage on you before you get to go back to space and go back to the safety of her out of your face, which will only last for a short period of time. She certainly has a crowd-pleasing style. No surprise to see her back in a high-profile slot here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 131 pounds. Fighting out of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, the chosen one. And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a kickboxer, making her professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. The professional! You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. Well, our staff guys are ready to score takedowns if need be, but given this matchup on paper, we're expecting really a glorified kickboxing match here under mixed martial arts. Rules. They can head to the popcorn booth right now because we don't need them. This is going to be all striking. Leave that grapple button empty. Don't touch it. Come Whoa! On. Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Oh, she's really using her reach advantage to great effect here tonight. Lands the punch. Nice kick. Right under the elbow, the body keeps landing. She blocked the punch. Big leg kick lands. Ooh, what a punch. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Oh, that's how you play if she blocks the shot and nails the straight counter. Just over three minutes now to go. 
you don't know when that leg kick's coming. Right hand upstairs. Well, that left hand has been there for her tonight, not on that attempt. Get the turtle in that kick. in some body shots. Oh, nice job by her there to split the guard and land her straight punch. That punch is so straight and so fast. She's having a difficult time picking up the timing of her opponent's strike. Big kick lands. Right back in the clinch. Look for the backhand to get very active. Big body kick land. Just unable to quite find that range. Keep going. Nice head kick. Final seconds here. Big kick land. Big elbow there. Oh, Almost five minutes down. Let's take a look back at some of the replays. You knew she came in with the book on her as a kicker, and her opponent did nothing to adjust. Her opponent didn't check one kick. So why would she not continue down that path? Why would she not continue to throw her hands just to set up those beautiful, nasty kicks? And she is landing them with full force every time she throws it. Oh, beautiful jab. She has certainly found the range with that weapon. And I guess when you have a reach advantage like this, you might as well use it. Nice punch, Lance. Oh, head kick. That one landed clean. Beautiful fight. Oh. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big punch land. Ooh. Real sneaky body kick. Try to establish that jab. And she did not miss there. This could be the end. I mean, she hurt her so bad with that big head kick. I don't know how she stands. Just over three minutes to go. Pretty good series of punches by her there. She certainly has found the range early tonight. She can box with anybody in the world, and she's showing that tonight. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. Oh! Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that landed. Oh. Beautiful body to land right under the elbow. Oh, huge knee to the body. That'll soften her up. Again, back into this position. Nice punch lands over the top.
starting to put together some significant body work here, and these are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Nice leg kick land. Beautiful strike. And she's back in the clinch. Look at how she drives her knee right into her opponent's midsection. Oh, the Superman punch lands. Oh, she lands. Scrambled eggs. I mean, that is a big shot to the head. I cannot believe she's still standing. So a lot of high-level striking in that last round, but the big shot, of course, to the head that stunned her opponent nearly got her out of there. I mean, she hurt her bad. I, I can't believe that we are going to another round. I thought it was over. She landed it perfectly. Usually, that's enough to end the fight. Unfortunately, the round goes on. Let's see what happens. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. Able to check the high kick. Just missed with the left there. Oh, she's really starting to put together some significant body shots here, attacking both sides now. Let those Punch over the top. Oh, hard work pays off, lands the Superman punch flush. Pinpoint execution on that straight punch. She's got a reach advantage, and it was pretty obvious in that sequence there. Big kick land. All oh, the right punches there for her left hand, also good. All right, so she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did in the previous round. As efficient as any striker in the division, this is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Nice punch here. Right hand landed. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, big elbow. And they separate. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Oh, massive kick lands flush. Does she have a soccer background? How about the kick there? I mean, she must have a soccer background because who kicks that hard? Wow, is she applying a lot of pressure here? I'm not sure how much her opponent can take. Clear sense of urgency here as she tries to make sure the judges stay out of it. All right, so again, the fighters clinch here. Kind of had a no big knee. You can never know what you're going to see with this young lady. Is she going to finish the fight? Oh, and with conviction, she moves right into half guard. Without much effort, she was able to pass from her full guard right into half guard. All right, full guard now, DC, and just because she has the top position does not mean she is not in imminent danger. Oh, she's in danger at all moments whenever she's in the full guard because they have so many different submission attempts that they can throw up at you. So she needs to pass. By passing the half guard, already eliminates a vast majority of those submissions. Move to half guard, then continue to try to advance to either get off great ground and pound or just positional advantage. Shot by her right over the top. Her opponent in a world of trouble now. Her opponent in a world of trouble. She landed that punch in the exact spot that she needed to. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. Oh, she continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like she did. Whoa! 
She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish this fight. That one is going to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> big kick land. sure her opponent knows where she is. She's in the octagon. Still. She can't possibly know where she is right now. After taking such a massive head kick. Good stick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Liver kick. Well, she's landed some good shots, but kind of point fighting a little bit, right? Nothing in terms of combinations. And that's the problem. When you start point fighting and you're jabbing and it's landing, if your opponent's landing more dominant strikes, you run the risk of the judge scoring for them. Right. Get in there, stick your nose in the fight. Don't be afraid to get a little bit dirty. Great punch. Oh, big left hand there. Oh, that right hand is on point. Massive head kick. Oh, shot she's thrown tonight. Her opponents are beautiful placement on that hook. What a great job of finding such a massive shot. Great move to buy her here on the ground, and she just does it so fluidly and so easily. It, it's really a sight to be bold. You can tell that she's been a lifetime developing the skill with the way that she's able to move with so little effort on the mat. While her opponent is squirming, and this might be the beginning of the end, the ground and pound strikes continue to land at will. more, Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at four minutes, 40 seconds of round number four. Playing the winner by knockout, the chosen one. Well, there she is, and you can be sure there's going to be a long line at the after party tonight after what she was able to accomplish tonight. I mean, she will be as popular tonight as she's ever been, because no